to Princess Ashley Balashade Adigoke. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenny. So guys, today's video will be about the reason why Oni of Ife did not make this beautiful black queen his first wife and the queen. You know, um, I've seen a whole lot of comments on the previous video I did and a whole lot of people were trying to say that because she's um she's already had a child that was why only of Ife did not meet her the queen because only of Ife knew her before Queen Naomi. So she has a daughter who is eight years old. I'll put the video a little clip of the daughter's video before I continue with this video. I'm going to say this little speech about children today. The greatest gift you give your children are the roots of responsibility and the wings of independence. So guys, this is her daughter. You can see that she's very beautiful and cute. She made this video when she was seven years old, but now she's eight years old. Old. so if you heard in the video she said she's seven years old she made this video last year when um i think during the children's day last year that was when she made this video so guys moving on to the main gist so guys moving on to the main gist yeah. so um people are still saying that she's not the new olori or olori she is the new olori the thing there is because she had a child that was why um the king did not make her the 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 queen you know she has been in the picture before queen naomi came and guys there is this um comment that i saw like the person wrote a full page saying some things about this lady saying that she's doing that like she was born with a sliver spoon that her father is this and that like guys that is not necessary i would have put the comments here but um, i think it's not really necessary or maybe at the end of this video i'll put the comment at the end of this video so that you guys will read because the comment is so long the person said a whole lot of allegation against this beautiful woman i don't know why people are still bashing her you know people has different personality if she chooses to be coming out on social media to make herself happy that is that is you know this life is just once she can do it she's a queen after all if you go to naomi's page she used to post something just like naomi is not um like is not this kind of person you know what i mean she's always concentrating on her her ministry work and all that but this is a young vibrant lady who spent most of her life in uk and her lifestyle is different her understanding is different too you know and guy there is this thing somebody said that she's spending the money made made for the orphanage the like that people are raising funds for her and she's using the money to you know take care of herself instead of taking care of the orphanage i was like what see this lady here yeah, she has a whole lot of pictures she has a, lo a whole lot of videos where she visited the orphanage like when i was talking all those videos some of those videos that was showing was her recent visits to some orphanage homes in 
in Ilife. And one thing I love about her is she's always doing her own orphanage in her hometown. Like they said, you know, they said charity begins at home. Some people might have start. Some people, if it's some people, they maybe they will just start doing their own thing. Maybe another city like all those, um like lagos abuja all those places that has big big names but she started her own in her hometown ilife to show you that she's down to earth see one thing about this life is it's not everybody that will like you right even if you 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 know you be, became the king or the queen it's not everybody that will like you you know but at the same time we should stop you know talking down on her She's just a human like us. She don't deserve all the hurtful words people are dropping on the comment section. Even me that did the video, some people were calling me names and the whole lot of things. Guys, it's not really necessary. What we bloggers or YouTubers does is just to gist you people what is what we had, analyze it you know the way we understand it and tell you guys what is really going on that does not mean that we are bad people you know we are not bad people and we don't hate her no no pain naomi we don't hate i don't hate people i don't talk down on people the thing we do in our blog is just to talk about what is happening you know the way it started and the way it ended I remember four months ago when I posted her picture and did video, a whole lot of people were saying, no, I don't know what I'm saying, I'm this, I'm that. But here we are, after four months, here we are, the same lady has shown herself. In fact, there is a whole lot of video where she attended an occasion with the king, you understand? You know, with the king, she attends the occasion with the king and yeah and they were you know praising her and the queen and the king sorry and guys one thing you should understand that queen naomi is not always at the palace these days she's always going from one church program to another is this is even this lady that moves around around with the the king you know naomi is not always at home she's moving around with her evangelism in her church stuff and other things you know and they said it's this lady, this beautiful lady that goes around any occasion that the king is, is attending, that she goes with the king. All those ones, we don't see them on videos. The, those ones they show us on videos are those ones that are attended with Queen Naomi, you know, to accord her that respect as the the queen of Ilife land, you know. But they said... Mm, most of the occasions the king goes with this lady because she's always there you know and she's this kind of people that you know she's as spoken you know she's smart queen naomi is smart and as spoken she's everything a woman you know is but you know she need to you know do you know queen naomi lives in um Ondo why the husband is in Life. She comes and goes. So what do you think? The king needs needs more queen that will be around him. You know sometimes if you know you can't do this, you can't handle it, you know. I think what I was expecting is like after Queen Naomi married the king she will minimize all those um all those things that will make her stay out of the palace for so long so that you know so that her as in there is a way they say it in broken that i go reach her ground so that she go no waiting they happen for her house i don't know if you understand me you know i know she's doing the work of god yeah i'm very happy for her but at least you're doing the work of god you should still be there for your home you should still be there to take care of you i'm not saying she's not taking care of her home but to an extent you don't need to be apart from your husband because you said they are doing you can still be doing the church stuff in a leaf there you know 
and people will still attend because it's the queen. So what I'm trying to say is people that is talking down on this lady, saying things that is not nice, even up to this moment that, that I'm making this video, a whole lot of nasty comments are still flowing left and right, which is not supposed to be. You know, one thing people should understand is who God has blessed, nobody can cause. So this lady has found favor in the eyes of the king. We should just pray for her. Even if she's this kind of person that likes social media, it's her life. You can't um deny her that because she's a queen, she should start living a fake life. I know she should control it so that it will not get into her head, right? She should control it, you know, and all that. But, man, we, we can't cage her. We can't cage her. She's an adult. She knows what is good. And all those things she's posting on the uh, social media, I think the king sees it too. So, if her husband is not complaining, who are we to complain? Who are you that is watching this video to complain and be saying that she's doing too much on social media? You know, just, yeah. I just came here to rant and talk about what is currently happening and the reason why the king did not make her the second, the, the, the queen, you know. So, thank you so much, guys, for watching. And honestly, guys... I appreciate your support. I appreciate your comments. No matter how the bad the comments are, the good ones also so surpass the bad ones. Thank you so much, guys. And I will see you guys on my next video. And I love you guys. Please, guys, remember to stay safe. Wash your hand. And, you know, stay safe. Bye.